In today's video, I have a battery monitor here and uh, it's designed for 12 and 24 volts configuration. And what I have here, and uh, as you have seen, uh, the battery, uh, the USB, uh, USB uh, charging port here, 12 volt USB charging port. And I still have my batteries here. Um, connected to a 12 volt configuration and I'm going to be using this new device to power up this new battery monitor so you can use it to power up um, the battery from this side with a plug with a um, wire that you can connect directly to this this is the white cable the red and white cable here and connects right there and right there close to the USB port. So this is the USB um, 2.0, 1.0. So it's a 12 volt, it needs to power this stuff. And um, and um, it has a sensor here, which is the temperature sensor, which is the yellow. And the black plug here goes to there. So I'm gonna give you the specs. You wanna read about it, it's gonna be the specs. And this is, um, O T A T O R C H, and it's a Bluetooth uh, capability. This one is designed to do uh, Bluetooth, and you can able to broadcast that you can be able to see it just like a BMS on your phone. So you just have to download the app, and you're gonna see if I turn this one on, there's gonna be a USB light illuminating here that's looking for the device as I speak. So let's go into it. I'm gonna go through this one on the next video. To show you what this ones are mostly is for loads so if you use like a, a dump load on your um like a resistor for your wind turbine and so um and so and so so on you can able to get this device right here tied into the going out to the load and this is the input of it okay and um, gonna be the negative it's got a positive side it has a battery powered uh, position right here. So pay attention to the the pictures I'm going to be showing you. See exactly how is uh, configured and live here at the JW Solo USA. Thanks for watching and let's power the thin device here by pressing press it. Yeah, look at that. So this is a power a DC power indicator or battery capacitor. You can see the blue lights illuminating that. That's the Wi-Fi system. So I haven't downloaded the app here to see exactly what it is. And um, you can able to see everything. And it's built like a 3D uh, configuration. I don't know if you can see that. These numbers are all sticking up. The zeros, they are way higher. The zero here, the red ones, they kind of bumped up. While the green ones are sinking and the purple one as well. The purple is going to be the energy. And uh, the red is going to be the power. The green is the current. The yellow is the voltage and I can able to set the cost uh, what's the cost it is now set like it's a dollar like sign and it's gonna tell you how much co2 carbon dioxide um, you already take from the atmosphere or something like that so or you saved and it's gonna show the temperature down here it's gonna be like a it's reading right now they point zero two four point three degrees Celsius so the temperature sensor is not even attached yet. So it's gonna be just, just a preamble to show you guys uh, what I have here. We're gonna go into detail and series of videos into this while we're gonna be putting it into test. Live here at the JW Solar USA. Thanks for watching. The new device is powering it up. I can able to hotwire it directly to the batteries if I wanted to. So you can power in different ways. So, which is a good thing. Then you can able to get this mounted and get a USB plug on this. And like the way I have it right now, plug your this device into it and get uh, your USB charging there. So it's a simple or clean setup. You don't have to have a lot of tangling wires everywhere. So this is all I gotta say right now about it. I'm gonna put a descript, um, the, the, the uh, specification on the description below. Yeah, you can read it for yourself. Thanks for watching. Love you guys all. Live here at JW Solar USA. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.